Working on the 91 uh, 43 car today. Uh, Got to get the old nose off, replace it with a proper nose. So we're grinding the seams to expose where all the rivets were, exposing a lot of Bondo and epoxy. Got to get all that ground out, drill all the rivets and uh, release the nose and put a new one on it. started out at 35 36 and in 93 i think they went to 36 36. I made yeah them even. yeah you could go they was opposite yeah. and they made them even yeah. so you do 36 36. so we came in from grinding the seam of the nose uh set the rod heights on the race car uh now we're just squaring all the front ends so i can when i cut the nose off i can get the wheel openings like they need to be uh, just checking the caster, camber, toe, all that stuff to make sure the wheel, front wheels are in the right spot. So, uh, just finished up, caster and camber's good, ready to roll. You want to recap? Yep. Okay. Well, we got the nose off the Pontiac today. Um, found out the bumper bar for the nose that was on it is kind of eh, not not up to what we would do, but it also didn't fit the grill opening. So we're going to cut that off. I made a new bumper bar for it. Got it clecoed into the nose. Uh, next step, I'm going to cut the bars off uh, the frame that we have now and hopefully tomorrow center the nose and start reattaching. <laughs>
big deal. I remember on Pinex, we cut this back and scalloped it even further, which made it more like a splitter that went further around the corner. Did that for a while until they got onto that. <laughs> we added three inches to it, so it would be the same length from the 10 inch mark to the to the kick out of the other makes. That's how they start equalizing them because the Pontiac was such a shorter car. Mm -hmm. When did they start running valences on them? Like a bolt on valence? 1991 we didn't. 94 was, was having, and, and at Roush's 92, 93, we had a bolt on valence in the Bush series. And I, I think even even the cup deal in 90, in 1991, we wasn't, 92, 93. So it was right in there whenever we started bolting on. So we're going to have to probably remake the fenders from from there around here forward forward somewhere in the middle of middle of the wheel it's already got a seam right here so i probably put in the same seam as the back half oh, there is a seam look at that we would we would suck that in because all that's going to be is a parachute oh yeah you can straight line that out you can straight out with the tires <laughs> typically from here somewhere between here and here you start fading that thing back in behind the tire not not parachute it out uh, I see what you're talking about because on this side it's puffed out around the tire and then it ducks in behind it I mean, unless it had to meet a template or something something goofy they had to do it I don't I don't know but I don't know that this car ever met templates after it was put back together mm -hmm. 